On behalf of the National Football League and the Baltimore Ravens, welcome to Hilton Elementary School. My name is Anna Isaacson, and on behalf of everyone here, I'd like to welcome you officially. Thank you. This is one of our favorite events during kickoff week because we get to work with community and bring together some of our great sponsors and partners to make our real lasting legacy in a deserving community. And we're so fortunate to be here at Hilton. This school was identified by the Mid-Atlantic Dairy Association and the Ravens for their active participation in our great program, Fuel Up to Play 60. Fuel Up to Play 60 is a collaboration between the National Dairy Council and the NFL, and it helps make schools healthier environments where we get kids playing for 60 minutes a day and we get them eating healthy food. And so we're so happy to be here. And quickly, I just want to thank United Way, of course, who after the school was identified, they really took over the reins and made this day what it is today. I'd also like to thank our great players for being here, Dwayne and Jamal. Our wonderful volunteer corps and our sponsors who took time out of their day to be here. And lastly, thank you to the mayor for being here, taking time out of her busy schedule. and to these kids for taking time out of school to be here and to share this special moment with us. I'm gonna turn it over now to Principal Henson to say a few words. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, Ms. Henson. <laughs> we are very pleased and honored to be the recipients of this year's um, United Way, um, Maryland Dairy Council, and fill up to play 60 volunteer project. On behalf of the staff and the students and parents and community of Hilton, I'd like to thank everyone for this. Thank you. Hi, I'm Gail Street. I'm with the Mid-Atlantic Dairy Association, representing <laughs> Dairy Management, Inc., and Fuel Up to Play 60. A lot of people have asked us about Fuel Up to Play 60. It is a program that's for kids, that's led by kids. We have 5,200 schools in the uh, Mid-Atlantic region, which is about five states, but Hilton rose to the top, and that's why they were chosen, because they have fully extended the Fuel Up to 60 program here. So thank you very much. Let's keep those kids eating. Oh, one other thing I did want to say is that there is a direct correlation between good nutrition, 60 minutes of play, and good test scores. And they will show that here at Hilton. Thank you. Hi, everybody. Mark First, President and CEO of United Way of Central Maryland. Can we pick a beautiful day or what? Yeah. Huh? Thank you, Gail. Um, we are so proud to be in partnership at United Way of uh, Central Maryland, United Way Worldwide with the NFL and the National Dairy Council uh, and the Baltimore Ravens, uh, creating these very healthy living spaces for these wonderful kids from Hilton Elementary School. Uh, we are very fortunate to live in the great city of Baltimore, not only home to the twice world champion Baltimore Ravens, twice. Uh, we're also home to many great organizations, companies, and volunteers who are also committed to making the region uh, a better place. None of this would have been possible today were it not for the volunteers who are with us, retired Ravens and Super Bowl champions Jamal Lewis and Dwayne Starks right behind us, all-star volunteers from local organizations including BG&E, Under Armour, the State of Maryland, the City of Baltimore, and United Way's own Emerging uh, Leaders United Group. We're grateful to each of you and your employers for committing to the health and success of the kids in our community. I also want to introduce Mark Fetting, the uh, 2013 United Way campaign chair, who's with us also. Great healthy uh, lunch today by Classic Catering. Thank you, Classic Catering. And all the tools today are being donated by the Baltimore Community Tool Bank. Wonderful, wonderful nonprofit. United Way's relationship with the NFL goes back 40 years, and we're thrilled to celebrate the kickoff of the NFL season today with this wonderful project. We know that far too many families in Maryland are living in neighborhoods where healthy food can be scarce. And without a healthy diet, children are, not, are more susceptible to health issues like obesity and diabetes, 
and also have a tougher time staying focused and concentrating in school. That's why United Way believes that the work that's occurring here today is so vitally important to the long-term success of these students. By providing them greater access to fresh fruits and vegetables and by giving them opportunities to play and learn outside, we're changing the odds for Hilton Elementary School students for years to come. So with no further ado, I'm going to turn it over to uh, Mayor Stephanie Rawlings-Blake. But before I do so, everybody knows she is the number one Ravens fan in the area. And do you remember what happened last April 26? She invited a mayor from San Francisco, Mayor Edwin Lee here, also a day of service. Uh, and I think they were painting a, a police station in West Baltimore uh, to pay off his wager for our Super Bowl win. So I know I speak for everyone here, Your Honor and saying, we hope we get to do it again next year. All right, good afternoon, everybody. Good Don't let the blue fool you. It's all purple under here. It's in my, <laughs> ravens are in my spirit. I want to thank Mark first. I want to thank Mr. Jamal Lewis, Mr. Dwayne Starks. And we give them a big hand and thank them for their for being here and these wonderful students who are here and so beautiful and well-behaved. I overheard one of, the, uh, one of the students telling Mr. Dwayne that they want to make a salad with the, uh, with the tomato that they're growing. I said, you're already thinking ahead to healthy eating, so we know that we're doing the right thing with this greenhouse. And I want to thank everyone who's participating in the NFL Community Build Project. All of the sponsors, I heard uh, Classic uh, Catering, who I love. I heard the, Bal the Baltimore City um, Community Tool Bank. Thank you for your work and of course the United Way. So the building of a greenhouse and the beautification of the garden will continue to help educate our students on growing plants and vegetables. We can see it's already working. The hands-on experience helps teach the importance of farming, sustainability, and healthy eating. The NFL Play 60 and United Way Activity Zone encourages movement. It helps students prepare for the uh, lifelong activity and exercise. I want to thank the Baltimore Ravens, the Dairy Management Incorporated. I'm a big uh, customer, so it, you know I'm glad it's, you know, you're reciprocating and bringing your resources to, to Baltimore. The Hilton Elementary School, Maryland Dairy Council, NFL Play 60, United Way of Central Maryland, United Way Worldwide. This project is a kickoff for the NFL season and the start of our Super Bowl defending Ravens. Another winning season for the Ravens. We have a, a week of activities in these two days. Today and tomorrow is going to be chock full of all activities, getting ready for the game. Has everybody got their wings and dip ready for the game tomorrow? Yeah, I'm, I'm almost ready, almost ready. But I know I can't wait uh, for the live televised performance of Keith Urban. That stage looks beautiful uh, at the Inner Harbor. It's going to give us another chance to showcase how beautiful our city is and what wonderful fans that we have. So I hope you, you come out and uh, celebrate with Keith Urban and th then get ready for the kickoff for uh, the Ravens versus the Broncos. My hope is uh, I know that the mayor of Denver, and I, I like him very much, but he had a little problem last time, paying up on his, de his debt after he bet. He called me, and I don't mind that part of it, but don't call me, you know, talking trash, talking about he was hosting Ray Lewis's retirement party. <laughs> and then after he lost, he said he was injured and couldn't do the dance. Then I saw him walking around. So I hope he'll be a little bit more gracious on this time around <laughs> in hosting our Ravens. Uh, so again, thank you everyone and congratulations uh, for your commitment to our young people and to the community. Thank you very much. Oh, and I want to thank Councilman Nick Mosby for being out here and representing in his purple, his Ravens purple. Thank you so much. With that, that concludes our thank you moment. So again, we want to just thank all of our volunteers for being here. The day continues. It is not over yet. We will have some food to share with you shortly. But now it's time to get back to work. Thank you. It's extremely important for the Ravens organization uh, to get involved, especially here in Baltimore City. This is our hometown. You know, we're thrilled that the NFL is here, and, and we're doing kickoff week for 2013 season. Um, but here in Baltimore, and this is where 
Um, we give back constantly and, and you know, we have resources and, and help with the United Way and, and the National Dairy Council and, and we're just super excited to be able to come here to help Mill Elementary School in Baltimore City and, and give back to the students here. It's just great to be back and, and be back in the city doing things like this in the community and uh, just letting these kids actually reach out and, and see us and touch us and uh, uh, just really instilling some good knowledge in them about health and wellness uh, through Play 60 and the United Way and their efforts and their partnership with the NFL.